Hello, beer tubers, and welcome to yet another beer review. With me, Peter, the master of hop hits, still out camping, shooting a, a actual beer review and not for the vlog. So maybe you've seen the vlog, maybe you've seen the other beer review. I don't know. I have always I have a ton of stuff to upload, but still here. It looks like it's starting to rain, so <laughs> I moved my tent into this shelter. So it's like tent shelter reception. Just, I don't want to get that shit wet. So tomorrow I'd had to, you know, wait for it to dry to bring it home. But in this review, guys, we're looking at a, another Australian craft beer. This should be really interesting. This is another beer I got at CBC. I got this from uh, my subscriber, Tom, uh, who was a volunteer at CBC. And this is apparently a fairly high rated beer. This is from Boat Rocker, and this is their Ramjet Whiskey Barrel Aged Imperial Stout on 10.6% aged in Starward whiskey barrels from the New World Distillery. Uh, so yeah, should be interesting. Barrel Aged Imperial Stout is always nice. And this is pitch black in the glass. I maybe poured a bit too much in there for you know aroma purposes, but pitch black, nice and tan head or whatever that's lace that's there not really a head but it's nice let's check out the aroma very licorice -y. and whiskey forward lots of licorice black licorice maybe some dark fruit toasty roasty oaty aroma too mmm charry I'm smelling campfire but that's probably because we have a campfire going <laughs> but Smells pretty nice. Let's give it a taste. Cheers, and thanks to Tom for the beer. That is a whiskey bomb compared to the aroma. And tons of dark fruit, like jammy forest fruits, and alcohol, and whiskey, and oak and vanilla. It's a little thin, though. It's like me higher side of medium mouthfeel. Uh, I'm getting currants as well, like it's almost slightly tart. Not tasting the alcohol though. The black licorice -y, licorice -y thing is there. A coca, a hint of coffee on the aftertaste. But lots of like uh, forest fruits, forest berries, which is appropriate because we're in a forest. Film the forest. <laughs> and you can probably still hear me, hopefully. And not too much of the music so I don't get copyrighted, but yeah, this is really good. Mmm. Not the best barrel aged imperial salt I've had, but it's quite nice. I like the oaky flavors, the kind of forest fruits, the char, and the vanilla and whatnot. Oak barrel. It's pretty good. So, rating wise, for the Boat Rocker Ramjet Whiskey Barrel Aged Imperial Stout. We're going to 93. It's really good, but it just needs more mouthfeel. And. I'm, like it's it is kind of tart. I'm no I'm not 100% sure if it's on purpose uh, Or if it's uh, you know, maybe some kind of infection got into it But right now it just it works with the rest of the beer. It's just like a tart forest fruit berry thing But it's still nice stuff. So uh, Thanks to Tom to Tom for the beer and if you get a chance check out the boat rocker Ramjet whiskey barrel aged imperial stout so rare that I get to try Australian craft beer. So awesome that I get to try it now. So thanks a ton, dude. And yeah, as always, remember to comment, subscribe, check out the Facebook fan page and Twitter and Instagram. And check out the Master of Hobbits Kickstarter that's running at the moment. And uh, yeah, I would love if you guys would pledge so that we could get some proper gear for different footage than just reviews. So thanks a ton to, for the support so far and cheers and see you guys in another beer review.